Welcome to this month's Nutrition Pearl, Oral Rehydration Solutions, Not Your Average Sports Drink, brought to you by the Council for Pediatric Nutrition Professionals. Oral Rehydration Solutions, or ORS, are not sports drinks, sodas, juices, or similar drinks which do not meet the World Health Organization, or WHO, criteria for oral rehydration solutions. These types of non-ORS fluids are typically high in sugar and osmolality and do not contain enough sodium. Non-ORS fluids should be avoided during times when a child is having vomiting or diarrhea. Some of these liquids are high in sugar, which can make output greater and contain inadequate amounts of sodium or potassium to replenish the child's losses via diarrhea or vomiting. ORS is recognized universally as the standard therapy for dehydration secondary to diarrhea. It is typically a mixture of glucose and salts mixed with one liter of water. The WHO has defined ORS as 245 milliosmoles per liter containing complex carbohydrate or 2% glucose and 50 to 90 milliequivalents of sodium per liter. ORS should be used for patients with mild to moderate dehydration and are accepting of fluids. It is not intended for use during copious vomiting or underlying disorders such as intestinal obstruction. It's an effective, safe, convenient, and inexpensive option compared to intravenous therapy. If the patient needs ORS for more than 24 to 48 hours, they need immediate medical assessment. This chart compares the WHO definition of ORS to other products. As you can see, those products highlighted in green are comprised of the appropriate electrolytes and dextrose composition closest to the WHO definition. Those highlighted in yellow and red are not comprised of the appropriate electrolytes and dextrose and can actually exacerbate a child's dehydration. Thank you.